on, I stand with Matt. The Renaissance Festival is coming up this weekend, but one favorite vendor will not be in attendance. He says it's because he brought his service dog to the festival grounds. Matthew Gordon has been known for years as the Sterling Renaissance Festival's pickle man, roaming the fair selling pickles to visitors. But this year will be different after he says he was fired for sticking up for his right to have his service dog with him. Every year leading up to the festival, Gordon says he walks with the service dog on the grounds to prepare for the big event. Up until this year, he says it hasn't been an issue. However, yesterday, he says the festival owner, Doug Waterbury, stopped him saying he implemented a new rule this year, prohibiting dogs from the grounds. I said, okay, well, she's a service dog, though, so she can go where I can go. And he said, I don't care. There are no dogs allowed on property, to which I said, that's, that's actually illegal. You can't deny me access with because I have my service dog. According to the Americans with Disabilities Act, businesses and nonprofits that are open to the public must allow service animals, even if they have a no pets policy. Gordon is a disabled veteran and he uses his service dog Faith for his combat related PTSD. Large groups of people, unexpected noises, things like that really hype up my anxiety. She's kind of trained to pick up on those cues and start me again so that I don't spiral. He hopes standing up for his rights serves a bigger purpose for others. Exposure of the fact that people that rely on service dogs constantly are fighting this battle. If my standing up for the rights of people having them inspires somebody to follow through with getting therapy and help to improve their daily life, that would be great. Gordon says he filed both an EEOC and an ADA complaint last night. We've reached out to the Sterling Renaissance Festival and its owner, Doug Water. Doug, where you at, dog? But have yet to hear back.